Call the law in law, Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, Shah, Bashim, Rakha, Kadash, double on the city apostles and elders of the great millstone for teaching us this truth. Today's lesson, Biden signs executed order for C-19 response. So it's just a small, short video, but I caught this devil right here it's on your on, on your screen, you know, doing what he do best, you know, uh, using his words, man, okay? And uh, you two-thirds Negroes who voted this, this guy in, Hey, you're going to get exactly what you voted for, you see. But while you was thinking he was going to save you from the other devil, you know, like the scripture said. Hey, man, you can't you can't run from this, man. It's, excuse the lock. It's impossible for you to run from this devil, man. When you have by Shini out and Shai has set him up, man. Let's get into the small video, Lord willing. We, this be an edifying video. We can come back with a free pre precepts. And let's get into it. The, the pandemic, excuse me, has disproportionately impacted on blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans who are about four times as likely to be hospitalized and nearly three times more likely to die. See? Here he is, man. Uh, why, he, why are they so worried about you Negroes, man? It's in, hey, it's impossible, man, for him to worry about you, man. But uh, let's get into this first precept. It says, Revelation 13, 11 says, And behold, another beef come up out of the earth that had two horns like a lamb and he spanked as a dragon see he coming as a lamb and he's spanking as a dragon man you don't see it right now until it actually kicked in man you know uh lord willing i put a, a link uh in the description box or uh on the comment board so you can see the whole video of it man you know and uh man hey the devil's getting ready to come in with great wrath man like the scriptures uh, uh said man He's about to come in with great wrath. You know, it's impossible for this devil to, you know, uh, 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 be anything but uh, uh, wicked, man. That's how Yahweh Bashim Yahweh made him, man. Okay, let's get into another precept. This is the book of Psalms uh, 55. And uh, let's see. Psalms 55 and. No, 55 and verse 20. Is this 20? Uh, verse 21, I'm sorry. And here it is. It says, The words of his mouth were smoother than butter, but war was in his heart. Or is it in his heart? His words were softer than oil, yet they were drawn swords, man. You see? Now, all of this, this talk this guy is saying, you know, which, you know, he, he pretty much, uh, uh, you know, put his foot in his mouth, man, before he even got into office, man. You know, with that, uh, I guess he had some kind of live screen going on where, you know, he talked to a lot of so-called black leaders, you know, and he was talking like, man, talking to them like they were kids, man. You see? Because they all been paid off. You know, they've all been paid off and in Esau's pocket. So, you know, you had to sit here and they had to sit there and listen, man, to this devil speak. Okay, and all he speak is wickedness, man. Uh, let's see if we can get into the second uh, precept. Uh, uh, let's see. I had a precept lined up. I'm trying to remember where it was. Uh, uh, let's see. It's uh, in the book of Ecclesiasticus. Ecclesiastes, uh, uh, three, uh, verse uh, twenty-eight. It says, "In the punishment of the proud, there is no remedy, for the plant of wickedness had taken root in him." See, that's how the Most High built this guy, man, to be wicked. Okay, just to to, to do the will of the Father, man. You see. No other way but to do what he's supposed to do, man. Okay, let's get one more precept and we can close it out. Lord willing, I'll put that uh, the, uh, the link in the description box so you can actually go all the way, you know, into it. Uh, this is the book of Baruch, chapter 4, verse uh, 25. It says, uh, My children suffer patiently the wrath that is come upon you from the Most High. See, this is the wrath that this, this bastard here... It's doing. He's doing the will of Yahweh Shimei Shah. 
uh, who you call God, man. He's doing the, 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 the work of the Most High, man, because the Most High know he is, is wicked uh, 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 amongst his, his children, man. And who is his children? You so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, who this guy here just, uh, uh, just named you, man. He just named you, you know. He wants to make sure that you uh, uh, get this so-called cure first, man. You see, what, what have they ever worried about you or made you think that, you know, they had any uh, 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 care for you, man? That's never, man, throughout history, okay? Now, why, why would they all of a sudden want, want you to be, uh, you know, uh, you to live? When the Georgia Godstone saying they, they want the a population depopulated uh, uh, to about, what, a little under uh, 500 million people all over the earth, you see? But he coming against you so-called Negroes, Hispanics, and Native Americans first, man. He coming against you, man. You see? But hey, it, it, it's hard to see if you ain't paying attention to it, right? Okay, uh, I, a scripture just, uh, a precept just popped in my mind. Uh, uh, we'll come back to that one, uh, Lord willing. Uh, we'll come back and finish this one right here in Baru. Okay, so we'll get uh, Psalms... Uh, Let's go to Psalms uh, 83, you know, and, it, and this, this, this still stands today, man. It still stands today, man. Okay. This is Psalms. Let's get to the point. Uh, well, Psalms in, uh, 83 and 2, it says, For lo, thy enemy make a tumult, and they that hate thee have lifted up the head. See? They, they that hate thee have lifted up the head, man. Hey, right now he, he's playing the part of, uh, of this uh, of the king, man, of Babylon. You see? They lifted up the head. They hated you, man. And they still hate you. It's a, like the scripture go on and says it's been a perpetual hatred. Verse 3. They have taken crafty counsels against thy people and consulted against thy hit ones. And this is crafty counsels, man, that they got, they got going on, man. We're saying that you know, they want you first, man. Okay. Uh, it says. Uh, it says they have come. They have said, "Come, let us cut them off from being a nation, that the name of Israel may no more be in remembrance." See, they have come together, man. It says for. It says for they have consulted together with one consent. They are confederate against thee, man. And see, and this is going into all the rest of the nations right here. Eat them. Which is the so-called white man. Here you go. You see. Uh, uh, Ishmael. Which is the Arabs. Moab. The Chinese. And the Hagarines. Okay. Them Africans man. And it goes on man. With the rest of them man. See. This a. Hey. This is a plot man. To, to, to knock you off man. You see. And if, and he gonna get uh, uh, some of you guys man. A lot of. Two thirds of you gonna get it man. It might not be the whole two thirds, but it's gonna be a lot of you so-called Negroes, Hispanics, and Native Americans that are gonna catch hell. You see, from thinking the devil wants to save you, man. Let's go back to the book of Baruch so we can go ahead and end it off. Baruch 4 and 25, it says, My children suffer patiently. The wrath that has come upon you said from the most high, but thy enemy have prosecuted thee, but shortly thou shalt see his destruction and shall tread upon his neck. See, and that's beautiful, man. So I want to give all praise and honor to you. How about Shimi Shah, by Shimri Kakadas, double honors to the apostles and elders of the great millstone for teaching us this truth. And shalom to the whole for elect.